Here at Billy's Black and Gold in Sharon, Pennsylvania, we met up with a local artist who has been practicing a traditional art form that's over 2,000 years old. My name is Carol Novosel and I live in Sharon, Pennsylvania. I've been working on eggs since I was six years old and I'm almost 50 now, so that's a lot of years. And it's a traditional uh, art using wax and dye, it's a batik process. Ukrainian egg decorating is a folk art. It's over 2,000 years old, and it's usually passed down in the family. It's a family tradition. So I learned from my baba, my grandmother, and my mom. And my grandmother came to this country in 1906. She was 16 years old, came with two cousins on a boat through the port of Baltimore. The only word she knew in English and had learned in her village was South Side Pittsburgh. So she knew that if she got to the south side of Pittsburgh, people from her village would already be working and living there, and she arrived. My grandfather was a few years older and said, when I can, I'll be in America too, I'll find you, and we'll get married. I, she said, that's wonderful, but I'm 16. If he loves me, he'll find me. If he doesn't, oh, you know, it'll be a new life. And my grandfather, and went to the south side of Pittsburgh and walked into the little Ukrainian church on Sunday morning and there was my grandmother. Carol decorates over 600 eggs a year and says it's an important part of maintaining her heritage. Painting the eggs is very important to me because it connects me to my roots and other people who might only remember that their family made pirohi or stuffed cabbage and that they celebrated Christmas on January 7th. Well, this is a link to their family. Not everything is black and gold at Billy's, thanks to the artistic talents of Carol Novosel. Her Ukrainian family tradition is carried on by the colorful eggs she crafts. Reporting from Sharon, I'm Amanda Hogger for the County Line.